Hello everybody. In this video, I will tell you how to install Vitry on <coughs> Amazon or Google Cloud with Linux. First, <coughs> you should uh, create a virtual machine in Google Cloud or Amazon EC2 and then uh, SSH into the virtual machine. Uh, first, you should update Linux server daytime to make it uh, match the daytime of your local server. And just come on. Yes, almost. Uh, uh, It is required that the absolute value of the time difference between the server and the client cannot exceed two minutes. So, uh, and the time is okay. The minutes do not exceed two minutes, so this time is okay. And now we will use the way to read on your the Linux. First, run this command. Then change to root user. Uh, okay. And then uh, run this bash uh, command to install way to read. On the server. Now, V2Ray has been installed successfully. Uh, use VM to edit the V2Ray configuration file. Ah, it's here. And uh, uh, go to this you are to generate the your unique ID and replace the ID uh, inbound client's ID in the configuration.json file. Uh, if uh, you want to learn more, you should uh, go to this link, way to read configuration overview to see more. Wait2ray.com. Okay. Uh, then you can enable way to read when a uh, system start and uh, this is a command to start, stop and restart with your service on the server. And after that you can uh, install way to read client. Uh, there are a lot of way to read client and I choose uh, way to read X in Mac OS and way to read N in Windows OS. Uh, this article will tell you how to configure all these uh, settings. If you want, you can uh, go there to see the details. And uh, uh, the next step is to add way to server port number in uh, Amazon or Google Cloud Firewall to let uh, way to service be accessed outside the firewall. Uh, you can go to this how to install shadow socks on go cloud linux uh, i'll go to see the uh, um, detail uh, i will help you to find the section uh, yes the first section create a firewall rule in Google Cloud. You can see this, this article, to create it step, uh, step by step. Uh, 
then uh, create Google Auto Machine instance. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, that's all for today's video. Uh, if you have a question, you can go to this website, devtodoit.com, to see more about uh, the details. Thanks.